स्कोप ऑफ स्टेटिस्टिक्स इन इकोनॉमिक्स दिस इज सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ योर सिलेबस इट इज अ वाइड स्कोप बहुत ज्यादा स्कोप है फॉर टू रीजन्स हेल्पफुल इन ड्रॉइंग कंक्लूशन अभी हमने कहा डेटा इकट्ठा किया एनालाइज किया उसके बेसिस पर वी कैन टेक कंक्लूशन एंड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ कंक्लूशन वी कैन मेक प्रडिक्शन पॉपुलेशन का डेटा इकट्ठा किया वी कैन मेक प्रडिक्शन वट इज अवर पॉपुलेशन इज लाइकली टू बी इन द नेक्स्ट टेन ईयर्स नेक्स्ट टेन ईयर्स में या नेक्स्ट वन ईयर में या नेक्स्ट टू ईयर में क्या होने वाली है एट वट रेट द प्राइसिस आर लाइकली टू राइस वी हैव कलेक्टेड डेटा अबाउट प्राइसिस वी हैव सीन द ट्रेंड ऑफ द पास्ट ईयर्स एंड वी कैन प्रिडिक्ट नॉट विद हंड्रेड परसेंट एक्यूरेसी बट बट विद सम एक्यूरेसी what is likely to be the behavior of prices if you are listening to the news on tv or radio rbi governor making predictions by march price level will come down to this by next year it will come down to this united nations making predictions about growth of countries you would must be listening to news india is likely to grow at 6% india is likely to grow at 7% over the next year over next 2 years over next 3 years how do they make predictions just sitting in the table and just decide that it will grow at 7% no they have a heap of data before them they have heap of analysis before them and on the basis of those analysis and past data the predictions are made in this way statistics is of great use in economics first thing statistics is indispensable if we list the uses indispensable indispensable for all branches of economics all branches of economics of course it is indispensable nearly all subjects maybe physics maybe chemistry maybe accounts maybe business studies maybe biology or all subjects by economics or economics ke liye iska relevance bahut hai another use we can say helpful in functioning of government how how can government decide what to do for the people in the next 5 years unless they have a data what is lacking what has already been done you will find that most of the departments of the government are engaged 
in collecting statistics in collecting data because without data government cannot move an inch government departments conduct survey and this conductive of sur of surveys is routine for the government because without that they cannot move further besides government helpful to businesses helpful to businesses how पॉपुलेशन का डेटा आया अगले साल इतनी पॉपुलेशन होने वाली है वट विल बी द रिएक्शन ऑफ बिजनेसमैन डिमांड फॉर माय प्रोडक्ट इज गोइंग टू राइस बिकॉज मोर पीपल आर गोइंग टू कंज्यूम इट नेक्स्ट ईयर डिमांड फॉर वीट इज गोइंग टू राइस डिमांड फॉर राइस इज गोइंग टू राइस डिमांड फॉर अदर थिंग्स गोइंग टू राइस So businessmen also take their decisions on the basis of data. So what what we mean to say? There is a great scope of data, scope of statistics in economics. In fact, statistics and economics are inseparable. particularly economics cannot move much ahead unless some data is before the economist uske bina unko unko aage badhna bada mushkil kaam ho jata hai keeping this in mind the scope it has a scope in economics it has a scope in business it has a scope in government it has a scope in other subjects let us note down some points of importance importance of statistics in economics one needed to provide systematic presentation of facts how do we present facts T uh, tables diagrams calculating averages and all that suppose you want to conduct a survey of school children unless you collect data about school children and their families you cannot arrive at a conclusion what type of students are there in your school what is their background how should school deal with them and so many things unless we have systematic facts with us we cannot take decisions
second needed for forecasting future trends forecasting future trends what is likely to be the population next year what is likely to be the population here what is likely to be the population of young people what is likely to be the population of old people what is likely to be the behavior of prices what is likely to be the behavior of growth over the coming years why why do they need this data government provides certain common facilities like roads parks police military water transport public transport schools colleges and so many things unless government can predict in advance what is likely to be the demand for these facilities in future next year or 2 years after or 3 years after how can they plan they have to plan finance they have to plan resources they have to employ more people so many things they have to do similarly businesses can also plan their future i gave you one example if they know population is going to rise not only population which part of the population younger older children because business man is interested in profit and he will like to produce only for those who can buy their products so if younger population is likely to be rise more they will move towards those goods and services which younger people demand so unless business has data with them they can't plan similarly consumers also plan on the basis of prediction how much to save next year how much more efforts to make to earn kharche badhne ja rahe hain chalo kuch karte hain to unless they have facts before them they can't plan then another need it for making comparisons compare comparison is our habit we always compare ourselves with others we always compare ourselves with our relatives with our friends so many things but here i'm not talking of individuals i'm talking of the country there is a institution called niti aayog niti niti aayog it is nothing but a new name for planning commission with of course change in composition but its activities will be similar to the planning commission earlier it was called planning commission 
तो वट विल नीति आयोग रिक्वायर वट विल प्लानिंग कमीशन रिक्वायर कैन प्लानिंग कमीशन प्लान फॉर द फ्यूचर प्लानिंग कमीशन कैन प्लान फॉर द फ्यूचर ओनली बेसिस ऑफ पास्ट ग्रोथ रेट्स past growth rates you will learn about the meaning of growth rate in the b part indian economic development but let me tell you growth rate here simply means rate of rise in production that is the simplest meaning we can attach